The Canadian Race Relations Foundation, CRRF, is a federal crown corporation and charitable organization established to foster the development, sharing, and application of knowledge and expertise in order to contribute to the elimination of racism and all forms of racial discrimination in Canadian society. In 1988, the Government of Canada and the National Association of Japanese Canadians signed the Japanese-Canadian Redress Agreement. Art Miki, the president of the National Association of Japanese Canadians, led the settlement. The rights of their civil liberties, in other words, the rights that they had were taken away. They were put into camps, they could not move freely in the country, for a period of time, they couldn't even own property. We want an acknowledgement that what the government did was wrong. We wanted some form of uh, compensation, individual or uh, group, and we wanted the removal of the War Measures Act because that was the act that allowed the government to not only intern us, but also confiscate our property and keep us out of British Columbia until 1949. So we wanted that act removed. And part of that uh, proposal we had included was the establishment of a Canadian Race Relations Foundation, some type of foundation to fight racism. The agreement acknowledged that the treatment of Japanese Canadians during and after World War II was unjust and violated principles of human rights. Under the terms of the agreement, the federal government also promised to create a Canadian Race Relations Foundation which would foster racial harmony and cross-cultural understanding and help to eliminate racism. The National Association of Japanese Canadians negotiated a contribution of $12 million on behalf of its community, matched by an equal amount from the Government of Canada to create a one-time $24 million endowment fund to establish the foundation. The foundation opened its door in 1997. And the first chair was uh, the Honorable Lincoln Alexander, a great choice uh, as chair because I think he has such a good understanding of racism. I was the vice chair with Lincoln initially, and today I'm just an advisor to the board, but uh, certainly I want to uh, see the legacy of the f foundation continue. The Canadian Race Relations Foundation is a very important um, foundation in terms of Canadian history around race relations, multiculturalism, equity and, and uh, diversity. The history of um, the Japanese internment, the Japanese people and Canada's response to what took place at that time um, was really the, the basis for a whole series of, um, of recompense and reconciliation and, uh, and a way of saying this happened in, in Canadian society, it was not right, it was a wrong, and here is a way in which we want to right this wrong. The Canadian Race Relations Foundation was opened in November 1997. After the bill, establishing it received royal assent on February 1st, 1991. The foundation is led by a board of directors appointed by the governor in council as selected by the cabinet recommendations from the Minister of Canadian Heritage. The purpose of the Canadian Race Relations Foundation is to promote racial harmony and cross-cultural understanding, to make for a Canada based on the mutuality of rights, participation, belonging and equity. An organisme comme uh, la Fondation est extrêmement important dans un pays aussi vaste que le Canada où diverses instances individuelles et collectives devraient se mettre ensemble afin d'assurer que le racisme est éliminé. Ce n'est pas facile d'éliminer le racisme mais des organismes comme la Fondation sont dévoués à cet objectif et c'est extrêmement important de s'engager collectivement à combattre le racisme au Canada, ce qui est euh, représenté euh, très efficacement Dans le travail de la Fondation. The Canadian Race Relations Foundation has executed many programs and initiatives that provide education, promote dialogue, and challenge Canadians to embrace racial harmony. In order to assist practitioners and further research, 
The Foundation's Clearinghouse provides a catalog of resources related to race relations, the promotion of Canadian identity, sense of belonging and reciprocity of rights and responsibilities. The resources include periodicals, reports, books, brochures, textbooks, videos and other media. I work to organize the library basically, which is the clearinghouse and I manage the materials, the books, the acquisition part of it, and I also manage the monthly Directions Open Access Journal, um, where we receive publications from authors, from academics, and we make these papers public so readers can read them, and they're available in both English and French. The Foundation works with teachers to provide expert advice on how best to engage in the teaching of challenging and sensitive topics, such as the Holocaust, homophobia and racism and has authored a well-regarded teaching aid, Doing the Right Thing. The foundation is now a clearinghouse of uh, racism, the incidents and so on. They provide information to any group that's looking for information. Uh, we do a little bit of work of training people. In 2018, the foundation produced a documentary titled The Science of Racism. The documentary explores new discoveries in science that show promising avenues for further research into methods for mitigating the impact of unconscious bias and the systemic injustice that can arise if such biases are left unchecked. The Foundation has also released an anti-racism public service announcement, which was promoted online and featured on television stations in Canada. C'est important de s'engager continuellement à combattre le racisme, qui est un phénomène qui est néfaste euh, dans, dans une société, euh, qui mine les relations harmonieuses entre Canadiens et Canadiennes. Euh, et c'est important euh, qu'on travaille ensemble afin d'éduquer la population à être sensible euh, aux impacts néfastes du racisme et euh, d'être sensible à la diversité dans la société. Euh, En général, le racisme provient très largement de l'ignorance. Alors, alors c'est extrêmement important, avec l'éducation, de combattre l'ignorance. Et en mission centrale de la Fondation, c'est des programmes de sensibilisation et d'éduquer la population par rapport aux euh, effets négatifs du racisme dans la société. The Canadian Race Relations Foundation achieves its core objectives through its ongoing series of webinar events on topics including extremism, hate crime, racial profiling, and indigenous reconciliation, and the publication of Directions, a journal that focuses on different aspects of race relations in Canada. The Foundation works closely with national research organizations to develop surveys that help to track changes in Canadian attitudes towards different ethnic, religious communities, towards policy issues, such as immigration and personal experiences of racism and discrimination. We're kind of getting self-educated in what it is to live in Canada. And it's more than Moose Mountains and Mounties. It's the people. We're an experiment to see if we can actually all get along together. And the Canadian Race Relations Foundation was set up to help us with that project by doing great research and by doing great outreach and by doing uh, a public engagement. That's what they do, and they do it really well. The Canadian Race Relations Foundation's Awards of Excellence program recognizes public, private, or voluntary organizations whose efforts represent excellence and innovation in combating racism in Canada. Also, one of the things that we do, I think it's important, is recognizing achievements. And so we honor uh, groups that are involved in having successful uh, programs, fighting racism. 
So that's the role that we're playing at the present time. The Canadian Race Relations Foundation strives to coordinate and cooperate with all sectors of society and develop partnerships with relevant agencies and organizations to create just, equitable, and inclusive environments. It's so important for us to support the work of the CRRF because any work that bring about awareness, any work that bring us together as Canadians, any information and examples that can be held up for what is and what could be a just society. I think that work needs the support of all of us in the society because we're building together. It's important to support the Foundation in its mission to combat racism at a national level because there are not many organizations qui, dans un pays aussi vaste que le Canada, sont capables de mettre ensemble toutes les instances et toutes les énergies pour combattre le racisme. Et dans cette optique, la Fondation a un rôle fondamental à poursuivre. I invite you to learn more about the work of the Canadian Race Relations Foundation and to make your contribution to building a strong and unified Canada. For more information on how you can support the Canadian Race Relations Foundation, visit crrf-fcrr.ca.